30 Minutes of Umoria, show 59. Hello! Welcome to 30 Minutes of Umoria, Fancy Code Edition. Let's get started. This, the 59th show of 30 Minutes of Umoria, is brought to you by the lowercase letter J. The lowercase letter J represents just one creature in Umoria. The Jackal. The Jackal is found at depths of 200 feet and moves erratically at a normal speed. It has an armor rating of 16 and a life rating of 3 die 8. It is a warm-blooded creature and susceptible to frost and to fire. It takes quite a while to see intruders, which it may notice from 120 feet away. It can bite to attack with damage 1 die 6. The Jackal. Before we get started, let's check out the Wheel Source Code. Let's take a look at some source code. Which function? The function the wheel stops on. Three, two, one, and stop that wheel. Get rand seed. Get random seed. Hmm, four lines long. R&D dot C. All right. Well, not much to this function, is there? Not a lot. Well, <laughs> it simply returns the seed, um, and the seed is global variable and set elsewhere. Well, it seems to be set in this function, set random seed. Um, as you can see, we have our own random number generator here. We don't depend on uh, rand. Uh, the system call. But uh, you know that uh, uh, random numbers can be seeded. The generator can be seeded so that they come up with the same numbers every time. So uh, let's just look and see where uh, set random seed is called, seeing how get random seed is kind of silly. Oops. Ah, set in a bunch of places. Interesting. How about get? Only one place. Miss one. Huh. When we go to set the seed, we get we keep track of the old one. <laughs> what a hack. What a hack. So anyway, that is get random seed. Not much to it. Short function. And that's the wheel of source code. Is the title screen, Umaria 5.6, James E. Wilson, Unix port from Cygnus support. What does Cygnus stand for? All right, here we go. You have trouble wielding such a heavy weapon. Your pack is so heavy it slows you down. Yishad is our character. Yishad is moving very fast but is slowed down by the enormous weight of stuff in his pack. He has two rings of speed and a slay undead faux shard that he can't really yield, but at least it shows us things that are invisible. We are at 1250 feet and we are all set up. We are good to go. There now we are. <laughs> to uh, clear the level and look for gain stat potions. We really have to fix our strength situation. We have found one of those potions so far, and we hope to find more. Berserker. There's a potion. What is it? Potion of strength. Just like, ah, just like that right off the bat. That's 
quaff it. You are full. Now our to hit is minus 20 instead of minus 30 or whatever it was. Let's keep searching. Let's find more of those. And once we find all enough of them, we will be moving very fast. Which is a great uh, sort of, what's the word, incentive. So what we're going to do is we're going to step on every tile. It's a lot of work, but I believe it pays off. Alpike. Is it a nice one? Nope. Look at all that gold. 33. 33,000. We are just over 50,000. Experience. Got to give these guys a little bit of space. Pretty easy to do because we are moving fast. Yeah, we don't want to do fire bolts against the red mold. Good way to drain your mana. All right, what's over here? Anything in this room? Just an elemental. Dissolved. Moving on. Anything in this room? Just a staff. Not even a useful one. All right, well, this is something. Another room. Nothing in it. I see that rubble or that loose rock over there. And I see an amulet. Dragonfly. I think that means acid. Banshee dead. Just a long sword. So we moved into the middle here. You want to get out of the middle. The middle is for final stuff. And you know what? When we check underneath that loose rubble, that loose stone over there, that'll be the last thing we do on this level. That's the way we're planning it. Potion. Not a good potion, though. Not a good enough one. Okay, we're in the corner. We're thereabouts. I might have been in a special room there. Hey, another potion. Is it good? Hey, metallic red. Restore intelligence. Ah, well. Now we have that identified. Not useful to us immediately. Probably one of the rarer uh, potions. Quaffing it might have been a little premature, as they say. Some of those phase door scrolls are around since the early days. And I still swear by them. Alright, that is the lowest part there. Moving on, moving on. Touching all of the tiles. That was quite a lineup of bad guys there. And there's more. Stone Golem. I'm glad he wasn't an Iron Golem. Those things are annoying. Spend all that time and... Ugh. Okay, that was close, people. Um, 
That was a scroll of word of recall that just got eaten up. Now we only have one left. A bit concerning. Could we even live to get all the way back up? I don't know. I do not know. Now we're playing with fire in a way. Because we only have one left. And that's the one we need to go back up town with. Hmm. Well, there's no way across this way. Gotta go in the middle. gentlemen, we found our first golden crown. Is it magical? Not particularly. It's worth a heck of a lot of money, though. Okay, we're not going to land on that one yet. Flesh Golem. Okay, this map, this board is nearly done. How about them apples? Gelatinous cube is always good for stuff. Okay, I spy a potion. Cure light wounds. Ah. We don't want that kind of a potion. What's over here? Nothing. Open that door. Step on the dial. Staff of Haste Monsters. They should call it a Staff of Hay Monsters. That's what will be going on. All right. I think that is it. Where was that loose bit? I see it. It's just north. There it is. All that for nothing. So we have to go up. I'm trying to manage our depth properly here. up in the dungeon, we can find, there it is, damn, 1200 feet, welcome back, let's do what we can do here, okay, I don't think we find any potions here. It's always in the next one. I think we only find them on 1250. Anyway, do we need to max out all of our stats? Some people like to. Um, these people are in it for the character development more than the win, I'd say, because you really don't need 18 uh, Charisma to beat the Balrog. You just don't. He doesn't care 
anything about that. And so on. You don't have to be as dexterous as you might think. But we're going to need all the mana we can get. And we're generally going to need all of the uh, hit points we can get. Hmm. Where are we? Let's get in this corner. Nobody home. It's over here. And check out this corner. Oof. How the heck did that happen? Ugh. Okay. What is it? Fire spirit. One cold ball, and that is that. So we have 51,000 experience points, gaining rapidly. Play Golem, dissolve right before our eyes. What's that? Hmm. Looks like we got a fancy room here. Let's check out this shield. Just a shield. Now what do we do? We're all the way over in the middle. Bottom middle, I should say. Okay, let's leave that there, like so. We're trying to step on all the tiles, light up all of the squares. Turn over all the rocks. Turn on all the lights. And here we are on the other side of the map. Haven't found any potions of note. What's that? Lance. And ladies and gentlemen, we have a flame tongue. Four plus four plus seven. And that is better than our frost bread. So we are going to swap it out. But it's 30 more pounds. Ah, we won't keep it anyway. Fine weapon though, fine weapon. Why do I say we won't keep it after I say it's a fine weapon? Because we're gonna find one of the two. We are going to find a Defender or a Holy Avenger. So, yeah, we'll have to throw away something. Okay, what do we have? What's that? Stone Giant. Got him. Okay, we've done a bit of a circle there. 
Let's do this part, shall we? Ugh. All right, just a shield. So, now what? Another orc dies. Look at our experience. Almost at 52. Hey, a gelatinous cube. Bring him on. Come on into the room there, big boy. There's one. Two, yeah, potion, cure light wounds, I want that. Ladies and gentlemen, we did it. We found a holy avenger. Isn't that amazing? A warhammer, three die three, plus five, plus six. Uh, plus three to strength. What's the plus four for again? I'd have to look it up, I forget. Wow, that is a keeper. We are going to keep that. It must be very heavy. Not that heavy. Okay. Now we have to figure out whether it gives us see invisible or not. So, we are going to drop that flame tongue. Isn't that nice? Wow. I'm going to inscribe it right now with 1,200 feet. Done. Whoa, how many, how many objects did we look at? How many swords did we identify? Uh, finally, after hundreds, hundreds, we found a holy avenger. So, we're just going to keep that right there. We're not going to put our... Uh, our enchant weapon to damn, enchant weapon to hit spells, scrolls, onto it yet. Wow, this is a very, very good game. Oh, I can't imagine losing now. Just can't imagine. Okay. Oops. One of polymorph. One of the things we're missing now, if I'm keeping track, and I am, is a defender. Holy Avenger Warhammer. Doesn't get any better. So, we're just about clearing out this level. Alright, let's get this. Wow, I'm still amazed. Holy Avenger. Is that it? Is that the last, uh, the final room? Looks like it. Well, I'm going to go down. It's kind of wandering aimlessly here. Where is the nearest? They're all the way up there. I'm going the wrong way. Okay, we gotta find something invisible. A K is not that. 
that ooze might be. No. Where's that flesh gone? So we're just going to kind of wander aimlessly here. Looking for, you guessed it, something invisible. Not a mummy. We're just kind of wandering in every which direction. Hey, look at that. We're going very fast now. That's because we're wielding our Warhammer that gives us plus three strength. Okay, that closet is usually invisible. This means that we are getting uh, the sea invisible from the Holy Avenger. That's good. All right, um, let's drop, teleport away, ID this. How many shields have you looked at? And not one has been, uh, in this character anyway, has been resist, resistant to anything. So, there's that. Just waiting for the right kind of room. It's safe. You cast all of these uh, scrolls in. This looks like a great thing. But we're out of mana. Look at that. We're so fast. Started at plus five, plus six. Got it? Plus five and plus six. Two damage. We have fourteen of those. Some of them are failing. A lot of them are failing. Wow. We're at plus eight now, that's pretty good. We have three of these to hit now. Worked. Failed and failed. Alright, plus six, plus eight from, I think five, six it was? Not bad. That is a keeper of a weapon right there. Wow. How is that plus four? I think it might be stealth now. Plus four to what? Plus four to sustain stat, does that ring a bell? So it's actually going to sustain dexterity, does that ring a bell? Anyway, wow, that is a good, good find. Store constitution. Moving on, moving on. Very soon, we are going to level up. It's 
It's a red letter day. Holy Avenger, two rings of speed, cap of intelligence. We're moving very fast. Okay. Not quite there. Where are the bad guys at? Where are the potions at? Don't know. There's a green ooze. Ugh. We are in a fancy room. This will put us over the top for sure. Over the top? Nope. Yes, we are. Look at that. 28. Level 28. We are a mage third class. We have 118 mana. Yeah, 71. How about that? And a potion. Poison. No. All pike. Just all pike. Okay. Well, let's try this on. Now, one more room here. Someone monster. Still too chicken to cast that. Once bitten, twice shy. Fool me once, shame on you. What is it? Anyway. Um, here we go. Oh, it didn't blind us. That's good. Awesome. So there might be a, a, an eating issue here. You might have to eat so often it's just annoying. left people. We found a Holy Avenger, we leveled up, and we finished this one. Alright, we're at 1250, we're gonna go up. Oh, there's still a little more of this level. I see it. There's the door. Let's go potions. time now. Maybe we can clear one more level. Oops. And with that, we'll leave it till the next time. Wow, what a great run. Wow. Nothing can stop us now. Nothing can stop us. <laughs> All right. Have a good 
game when you play, and we'll see you next time. Bye-bye.